engineer Michael Krieg is braving the frigid waters of a test pool at the University of Florida. He's putting his latest mini submarine prototype through its paces. In another part of the lab, his colleagues are gathering data about the aerodynamic properties of a micro air vehicle in a wind tunnel. Both of these machines will one day work hand in hand to provide an unprecedented amount of real time data about hurricanes. According to Cameron Mosseni, the head of the lab and a professor of engineering, the intensity and trajectory of developing hurricanes are difficult to predict. The interface between the ocean and um, atmosphere is critical in fueling the hurricane. That is exactly the part that we are really missing to estimate. How do you get that boundary condition to fit to your simulator? Mosseni and his team believe the answer will be found in machines like these. Small autonomous aircraft designed to fly into the heart of growing storms and transmit real-time data about atmospheric conditions. He envisions a day when hundreds of his tiny planes will swirl around inside storm systems, gathering and transmitting information, using the kinetic energy of a hurricane's winds to stay aloft. If you use many of these little chips or uh, vehicles with sensing capability, you could get significantly higher processing capability, communication capability, coverage, uh, sensing capability at an aggregate level. But Moseni says aircraft can only paint half a picture. To be able to predict a hurricane's path and intensity, you have to know what's going on beneath the water as well, which is where Michael Krieg's submarines come in. The vessels are tubular with a rear propeller, making them ideal for traveling the long distances needed to reach a hurricane in open waters. And they are also extremely maneuverable, thanks to internal thrusters designed to mimic squid. They suck in water through this little hole and they shoot out a high momentum jet through that same hole. And it's very similar to the way a squid swims through the water. And the, the squid, you know, sucks in water into its mantle cavity and it shoots out a high momentum jet and it gets a lot of propulsive force out of that. Enough propulsive force to keep the tiny sub stable while tracking a hurricane underwater. Moseni says that by combining the data provided by these small machines, weather models of the future will be significantly more accurate when predicting the track and intensity of hurricanes. He says there's still a lot of research and development needed before his drones are ready to tackle hurricanes. But he says they will eventually help save lives.